Yo, what is going on guys, DJ Skittles 88 here, welcome back to a brand new video. In today's video, I'm going to be showing you how I make my beats, I put it on SoundCloud, so make sure to go follow me. I also put it on YouTube, and yeah, so the website I use is called Loop Labs, and so basically this isn't like a really professional website or, at, or software, but it is really fun, so I'm going to show you how to do all the stuff. And so basically all you need to do is make an account sign in and then you're click on studio and then you're here it takes a little while to load this isn't like the best lo working website but it is pretty awesome all right so the first thing you want to do so basically i have some saves these are all my saves and so i have all these instruments but if you guys don't want to use any of them you want to make your com completely on your own go to the music key little section and look up an instrument and then a genre if the instrument you don't want if the instrument you want isn't there just type it in so I'm gonna type in flute because it isn't there but it is in one of these kits and so let's wait for it to load and here's uh, some flutes that you guys can use and they're all located if you don't want to type in flute just I guess you have to like search around for and, and like all of these kits there's a lot of kits there's like a, a freaking t there's a ton Alright, so the first thing we're gonna do is we're gonna go to where I saved my song. And the cool thing about this is it shows you all the instruments that you used, and it also shows like it gives you where the position is, and like it just basically gives you the whole song if you click on all of these. And so I have bass squares, which is a really cool sound, like really cool bass. It's more of a synthy type of bass. So let's play it. So yeah, it kind of has like an intro type feel, and so that's pretty cool, I recommend using it. And so now I'm going to move on to my main melody of the song, Loose Accordion Flute 01. If you guys want to know the exact uh, instruments, then just search it up. And so here, I'll type in bass, what was it? It's bass dot squares, so bass dot squares. And enter and then it should come up in one of these like it should <laughs> I don't know what's not coming up now but yeah so basically you also have these cool drums badass and house drums if you're gonna make a hip-hop song sometimes you're gonna need to go into other genres of drums or any it's any instrument in general so yeah when I first started off when I made a hip-hop song I used EDM drums and they're the best I didn't choose a very good one for my first beat, but there are some good ones in the other genres, dubstep, trap, whatever. And so I'll show you how it sounds with the, the, all the drums. And then I'll show you later what it sounds like with the bass and the kicks and this, all the final stuff. So yeah, you guys see it sounds pretty good. These uh, drums are really good. They have like, the full package. They have the, the bass kick thingy the snares so you don't really need a snare they have claps and all that and so it sounds pretty good and so we're gonna go back to my saves we're gonna go to hero bass drop now this is a really good bass i really like it it sounds really good so yeah i'll, I'll play it i'll skip the, i'll skip the intro part for now and just go into there so yeah hopefully you guys can hear it well and then we're gonna add an edm kick which it's pretty cool, I like kicks a lot. And then I'm gonna also gonna add a percussion. You guys don't really need to add a percussion, I just like the way this sounds. So it'll be like... It's kinda like a bongo drums, almost. See, it kinda, the bass are really cool, I really like the bass. And that's basically how like I laid out my instruments. If you guys wanna, wanna know, all the instruments I use and what they sound like all together and so Loop Labs kind of does a weird thing where it kind of positions it and so it makes it your own song but you guys need to figure out how to position I can't really tell you how to do it because you, gotta, you guys need to figure out how like what kind of song you want and so yeah I kind of want to make like a little Uzi, little Mosey type song and so I have like 
the intro, and then I have that, and then I have a, I don't know, it's kind of confusing, but if you guys want to see all the stuff easier, go to zoom out, and then it'll be easier to see it all in like one little section, all you need to do is scroll up and down, rather than side to side and up and down, so I'm going to zoom back in, I don't have that much, and to change the BPM, you can change the key, there's some effects. I'm trying to keep this, I guess, like as short as possible because other other recordings I've done on this have been like 10 minutes. And I want to keep this video kind of short. So you have distortion, a chorus, all of this cool stuff. And then if you click on the like wave bar, I don't know what to call it. You can do the tempo, the pitch, and all that. So it's really like it's pretty powerful actually. And if you want to go to edit, edit is one of your. It's gonna be one of your best friends. You can redo, unmo, un. Redo, undo, split is a really cool feature. Split and join are pretty cool. So if you want to change a part in a song, so I'll do that. I'll hit split. And then basically I can do whatever I want to this part. I can hit sample editor and then do whatever. I'm not going to do, I wouldn't recommend changing it. Like what? I don't know what that was. But yeah, then you can hit join and it'll be like one. Wait, what? It won't be one? Okay, never mind. You learn something new, I guess. And then delete selected. And then you can select, select all region, whatever this is, and then duplicate. And so, yeah, that's pretty much it, really. And so, yeah, I also wouldn't recommend hitting record. And so, what I would do is I would save it, download it, and then put it in Audacity, and then record your vocals on like over that, so to make it easier. And so, yeah, you basically just need to find a bunch of different sounds that you like, that you sound, I think you, that sound good together. And you can do effects to make it better, I guess. And yeah, and so how to publish it is you need to uh, title your track. I'll just name it track. Hit enter, and then it'll save it for you. And then you can hit uh, publish. Publish. <laughs> and so if you publish it, it'll be on your Loop Labs account. And so you can go to your. Uh, view profile and so you can go to your account profile and then you can find the song and so yeah and so you can update your pro whatever and so basically there's a little download button right here next to the comments comments so it'd be plays favorites comments down download now and studio and options and so yeah that's pretty much it how to make a really cool beat I would recommend if you have the money, obviously go buy FL Studio, Ableton Live, whatever, Logic Pro, I don't know what they use, whatever they use, but if you guys don't have a lot of money, your computer isn't that good, or whatever the reason you, you guys don't understand how to do it, this will be a quick tutorial on how to use a really awesome software that is free. There's a lot of cool stuff in it, The only my only gripe with it really is kind of the loading time and that you can't import your own sound so if you download a kit you guys won't be able to like import it which is kind of annoying but i mean i guess whatever so you guys can make a lot of cool songs with it and yeah that's pretty much it for today's video thank you guys so much for watching if you guys want a part two if i didn't if it didn't make this specific enough then yeah comment down below and leave a like subscribe we're almost at 150 subscribers which is pretty cool if you can hit it by the end of the year that would just be amazing but yeah, thank you guys so, so much for watching. I have a lot of awesome videos planned for you guys. Yeah, thank you guys so much for watching. I'll see you guys next video. Digital is 88. Out.